All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Bombs and Bangers. Gang, you gang. should already know what it is. It's season two. We're back from the holiday break. 2019. I hope you guys like the holiday special. Like the video. Subscribe to please, the channel. Please, please, please. I'm your host, GQ, a.k.a. Johnny Bravo. In the building, once again, we have my boy, DJ. Two tickety, 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 tex. Thank you, thank you, always. Uh, Welcome back, fam. Showing up. Thank you very much. How was your New Year's? Uh, amazing. Wonderful? Amazing, amazing. How was your Christmas? Uh, amazing. Wonderful? Amazing, Edie. Yes. You? Oh, you it was good? fantastic, oh, baby. Gosh, it was fantastic. We got to we got to talk some... over this week, uh, over these holidays, because we've been so... all over the place for a year. Well, wow, man. When our you... schedule's been fucked, right? But when you got so much family stuff to do, you know? We're back at this We're back at this shit. We got some upgrades in the building. We got the new microphone. Yep. We got the tripod for the camera. Yep. We're going to have a new bomb come in. Yep. Just wait yep. and see that. Shut up. Bye. Shut up. Shut up to you, G. Yes, yes. Thank you very much, sir. No problem, I appreciate no problem, it. I appreciate a lot of hard no work that went into it. First episode, first episode touched 220 nice. views. Shout out to you, G. Thank you. You might not Thank hear that, but shout out to Thank you to you, get man. all this I done. I appreciate it. I know you did a lot of work, you know, I know you put a lot of time into that. So, salute to 2019, brother. Thank you, brother. That's salute. All the, shout out to all the, all the people in 2018 that looked out for us. Thank and you. shout out for all the people in 2019. Me and two really appreciate it. Salute. So, what we got on the menu? Woo! Woo! It was a good one, eh? That was beautiful. It was crisp. I needed that shit. All right. Hey. All right. So, we left off with a holiday special that we did in Michelli's house right. on Legalization Day. Nice. That episode, we shot the day before we shot you and Controversy C. Correct. Correct. So we dropped that for the holiday special. It was absolutely lit. Nice. Yeah. Um, I used the Gucci intro. Nice. We got hit by Atlantic, but they kept it up. So nice. shout outs to you guys. Thank nice. you guys for leaving it up. We nice. appreciate it. Nice. I know we used it. I know we used the song, but it's all good. It's shout all good. Man. That's what's up. They were cool. They were cool with it. Love so. it. The love is nice. Yeah, you know, we really appreciate that. So first up on the docket, we got some topics to come back and kick it on. The first big project we're going to talk about is 88 Glam. Right. 88 Glam 2. T-Dot's own, right? T-Dot's own. So the album had... um. The first single was Lil Boat. Okay. Um, absolutely crazy. Right. Running everywhere. Right. Every radio station right, right. now. Insane. They got Nav on the feature. They've got Gunna, Rax. That track is fucking nice. hard. Nice. That's probably like my favorite feature on there. And um, <clears throat> my second favorite record on there would probably have to be, I don't know, it's a tie between Blue Faces and Wet Dreams. Boy's doing his thing, man. Woo! Man, boys those doing boys are doing their thing. Derek Weiss, Glam Boy, fucking 88 Camino, doing big, big, huge but, things. But that, but that makes sure it happen only because because of the weekend, right? Like, yeah. These guys are random guys from ra random. Well, Glam sex, Boy so. or 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 Weiss or I'm pretty sure he goes by Glam Boy now. He he ran around with OVO. Okay. I remember seeing him in a couple photos, yeah, OVO, I, 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 The Weeknd, so, yeah, yeah. he was running around yeah, in that yeah, camp. Yeah, yeah. He was already well known, like, just like, I'm pretty sure for his lyricism, I'm pretty sure he was a rapper before yeah, that. Before yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, he's nice, he's nice. If I'm sure, like, I'm pretty sure I seen him do some do some records before that. Right, right, yeah. yeah, yeah, he's nice, he's nice. If I'm sure, like, I'm pretty sure I seen him do some, do some records before that. Right, right. And then he came with this other guy, Camino. So I guess the weekend put them together. Yeah, yeah. Because, yeah. cause, um, I, like, I didn't see them two, like, really doing anything until I noticed the weekend was in the mix, right? So I go, fuck it. And then, like, you know, they signed, they signed their XO. Uh, that was the first time right? I seen that other guy, Camino. 
True. True. Was when they came out with that first project. True. But the, the, they're, they're, they're hitting some numbers right now, bro. They're doing their thing yeah, right now, bro. bro. And they're repping because they're a lot of their they're, thing they're, right they're, now. They're, they're in that... They're in that limelight of you know T Dot's glory. They're 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 stuck right in the middle. They're, they're stuck right in the middle. They're in a perfect spot yeah, exactly, where exactly, they can exactly. propel their career literally to the next level from where they are right now. Exactly. They're and they're, and they're, and they're behind some good guys. You know they got weekend behind them. They got perfect. Them, you know perfect I mean? production. They're in the right circles with the right people. You can't go wrong. You know, you're absolutely right. These guys got some crazy production levels, right? Eh? Crazy, like, bro. I don't know where they're getting it from, but yo, when I first got on, I'm like, I didn't even know these guys were from. Toronto. I don't know if that's like, there. I don't know if that's Camino's ear bringing in that interesting sound because yeah, yeah. he's an interesting guy. Yeah. Like he's he looks like a different kind of rapper. Like he's got that rock star persona. Yeah, yeah, so I don't yeah, know if that's true, his true, ear true, bringing true, that in, true. or like that's him working together with but the fun. weekend combination. Either way, crazy. And, and and you know you know Draco signed all these guys, so I'm pretty sure they get all their producers, all their the links, and all, you know what I mean to the, to the engineers and the bro. Producers. When you're they're getting, they're getting when good, you're running they're in those good. kinds of circles, there's no way yeah, that you're not yeah, exactly, you're not exactly. fucking with the upper echelon of the music well, industry. And, and that's what I mean. They're in a good place right now. So I mean, shout out shout out to 88 Glam. Yeah, right? shout boys, out to 88 Glam Glam, Glam boy, rapping. fucking Camino, yeah. 88 Camino. Those guys are fucking hard. And their for videos real. are. are uh, uh, they're like dope. They're, they're dope yeah they're, they're different dope. Yeah, I, I like them man i like them they're not the the average you know what i mean no they're in very the club, they're, they're very, very interesting like, yeah, like very yeah. very, yeah. very introspective yeah. Yeah. like the videos are, yeah, yeah yeah for sure yeah fire good. no no I, I i rate that so they're they're like i said they're behind a good a good path and i think they, uh, you know it's, it's it's only up for it's only up right now for these guys man you know I, they stick I, the way they're doing i think their next step if it if their next step is the is the big one, then they're gonna propel their career really far yeah, with yeah. that next one. Yeah, and I see it because right now, right T-Dot, spot, you know, T Dot's on a big uprise, man. You know Huge I mean? uprise. So bro. I like I I can see them, you know, holding some of that on their shoulders, right? So shout shout out shout out to shout out absolutely, to you, man, for, absolutely, for absolutely, sure. man. So another person that's been going crazy this year, Lil Baby. <laughs> Going crazy, crazy ain't even the word. This nigga, this nigga, he's on everything. Everything. Like, I could like turn a corner and he's on tracks that I don't even think like he's gonna be on. Like this is the kind of level I... he's in. And he. All right. So, pure cocaine. Right. So pure cocaine was absolutely ridiculous. Mm. This beat was just fucking insane. Mm. I don't know something about it captured my ear instantly mm. all right so i watched the um, the documentary mm. little baby the Lil preacher baby. man the yeah. preacher man yeah. documentary the world star one so sick so like he's been around the meagles for a minute and now he's starting to get now like he started to get into his own bag right. so it's kind of like glam boy right, right. he was around them boys right, before right. and then kind of like i guess somebody convinced these dudes yo you need to rap Bro. Right, 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 right. You know what I'm right, saying? Right. They're spitting a freestyle together with the nice, boys. And they're nice, and they're nice. Crazy, crazy. And they're nice. So, then he's got the feature with Meek Mill, Time. Mm. Ooh. Mm. Mm. Meek has mm. been an absolute sap. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I don't want to, I want to get into championship. But I want to wait just two minutes, two minutes, because I want to finish covering it's a good this. Segue, though. Yeah, <laughs> so we're gonna go back to time. Mm. All right. Um, he had two chains feature. He had a Gucci man. Fe- he had two Gucci features. Mm. He had a Young Thug feature. Um, this song right here, fucking word on the street, mm. fire. Mm. Another one of my yeah, favorite yeah. tracks. Baby, um, sorry, Baby has really shown like. Lyrical capability. Oh, hold on. Two Tex is hitting a brand new toy that he just got for Christmas. Very special toy. Actually, is gifted by Controversy C. So shout outs to C once again. Shout out C. You always make it on the show, bro. <laughs> when he's not me. here, you find when he's not way. here. <laughs> and shout out to all the people that came out to, you know what I mean, fuck with us on all the episodes and. Took their time. 
took their time out to come, you know what I mean, and make sure that that we were kind of taken care of, uh, you know. Uh, showing us love. Showing us love. And, yeah. like, really, like, interacted with us on... Yeah. on even on a business on social level, platform. You know, even even like even though we're friends and you know, we still did our thing, it's like it's still good on a business level. And you know what? Shout out to all the people. It that. means a lot to the people yeah. who are building this, like me and Two Tex. Yeah. Two Tex has literally been there from the beginning since I had the idea to start the show. So like to when he sees the views and like the support that we get it's, it's only love, man. It's love, yeah. you know it only makes him feel better and it only makes him want to come back more so yeah. the more views that you guys show us the more love that we appreciate shout out, shout out to so that, shout for out sure. to you guys for man sure. for real um but let's jump back into this record time me yes. yes and Lil baby so ever since meek got out of jail mm. He's been on like a headhunt, bro, basically, he's bro. He's been like crunching. Holy! Like I don't know what that la that last that last one, bro. That put him in a real deep place. You know what I mean? A real dark place because. Yo, so Meek is okay. He's so going crazy ham. It's like he's, he's like, not okay. So he's not even talking about the same shit anymore. That's what I'm saying. He on like, his features on his album, yeah. he's not talking about the same yo, shit. He's pretty. He's pretty up there right now, man. But he's doing his thing. He's still making some hardcore shit. That's why you gotta fuck with him. You, you know what I'm saying? You can't, you can't deny me. You can't, yeah, you that's what I'm saying. It. And he's nice. He's getting good productions. He's fucking with the real people. Like, his he's, production he's, is on, fucking He's got everybody. He's got everybody, bro. man. That Shut Uptown up, man. Vibe. Shout out to fucking me. That by the way, Uptown Vibes record with again. Fab. My God. Yo, bro. I, listen, it's... I, I, remember, I remember when people used to say, you know what? You, you you wouldn't be able to hear him. You wouldn't be able to hear. Him. You wouldn't be able to hear him for like for all, for for like a whole a whole song or I mean a whole album or something like that, bro. Championship. That redefined his whole sound. That nigga is a champion right now, bro. That, that redefined his whole that, that nigga is a, sound, nigga is a champion bro. Right now, because you know what? Dude, he it's a back to back. You don't even have to change. You don't have to, you, you you don't have to touch the. You just no no. In, you just leave it. it. You just it. let it play right through. He 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 showed up. Not only that, did did he prove every motherfucker wrong? Wrong. Everybody, every motherfucker out. Facts. And shout out to Meek Mill for that. Woo! And he's still coming with the fire. Nah, you gotta give you gotta give credit where credit is due. And you know what? I'm not even gonna lie. I was a really, really heavy Drake stand when the beef started. I was like, oh, there's no way. Like, how is Meek ever gonna come back from this? This is a rough one for him. They, they and I they fucked they, with Meek. They, they like, they my it. dream... Like, I, I was a serious yeah. dream... Yeah. Like... Dreams vs. Nightmares, Dream Chaser, heavy, heavy enthusiast. So when I saw him put down Meek, I was kind of like, oh shit, that's kind of disappointing, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But they, you know what, they both came back very well. It's like, it's almost strategically planned. Like, it was so well played out. Well, there bro, you. you know what? In the end of the day, Ross, Ross is boys with Drizzy. Yeah, it was. So that, that beef was going to get squashed. Yeah, it was just yeah. a matter of time of when they were ready to talk to each other because yeah. it was already in the air. You know what right, I'm saying? Right, right, right. And, like, it's devastating to see two. Just yeah. a matter of time of when they were ready to talk to each other because yeah. it was already in the air. You know what right, I'm saying? Right, right, right. And, like, it's devastating to see two artists, especially lyrical artists, because it... Go through some shit, right? Some dumb shit. Some... It, it's just some dumb shit. Like, I don't mind, like, regular beef, like, 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 play shit, like, yeah, yeah. Tory Lanez yeah, yeah, or Joyner yeah, yeah. Lucas type yeah, like shit. fucking around with each other, yeah. You know what you I'm know, saying? I thought that was serious at the beginning, by the way. <laughs> Did you really? Yeah. I was, I like, wasn't, oh, here we go. Here's another one. I wasn't <laughs> sure, I wasn't sure at first how to take it, and then I was like, and, and then I read the shit. Instagram post, and I was like, oh, no, this They're is a joke, this is a joke. I'm like, they're fucking around. So like I don't know, but to see to see them go through that and to see Meek come out strong, I feel I feel upset that he had to go through what he had to go through to become this monster. But like mm -hmm. yo, it's only it's 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 beneficial to us. Like I don't want to look at it like that, but like you know, like Meek's a champion, bro. Yeah, he's, yeah. he's a warrior. He, he knows. Doesn't kill you. It's only gonna make you stronger, man. Meek is a fucking he's, savage. He's been through the jungle, man. You know what I mean? This is just. Um, things that shape, shape, uh, you know, a man, 
you know, think and, uh, and be a certain way, right? And he's, that's what I'm trying to tell you. He's on a level right now where, um, man, he, he, he's like, he's in a matrix. He sees everything right now. You know what I'm saying? The way he talks is, uh, uh, you know, the, he, it's he more is, intelligent. Yeah, he, he, you know what I mean? His, uh, the way he backs up his word, like, he, he, he's not scared, like, right, right now to talk about it. So, but he's doing his, he's doing his thing. He's still making a, amazing music. Absolutely like, a fantastic yeah. album, bro. Like, I'm on right, Saturday, so like, so they're bumping, fucking killing it, like, everywhere. Like I want to dive into championships a little bit, bro. You know what I mean? It's like, because you can't even not. <clears throat> okay, so. It, <laughs> the, the, <it's> everywhere. <laughs> the, the way he, the way, the, uh, okay. See, it got me stuttering, bro. Because yeah. the way he started the album alone. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, the intro. With that intro, Ooh. with the Phil Collins intro, Ooh. boy, you better stop right now. Ooh. You better stop that shit right now. Ooh, boy. He is not playing. Yeah, he. It was. It was. It was. It, the whole. Uh, the whole. What was it EP album? No, what album, you want to call album, it? Full album. Um, like he was on a different fucking level, bro. So Out like, of this he, realm. Yeah, yeah, and and man, I can only. I can only. You know, which should I, I can only see, see good for him, man. You know what I'm saying? Shout, shout, shout out, shout out to me to, you know, for his big movements, man. And all right, so what's he's progressing, bro? <coughs> Not for real. <coughs> so, <coughs> what's free? Oh. Stupid, stupid. Absolutely ridiculous how he flipped that. Un fucking believable. Oh my gosh. Can I say, by the way? The respect for old R, uh, old R and B and hip hop beats, man. Shout it's there. To it's there. Right it's now there. It's not the old nineties shit. It's coming back. People I yeah. fucking love it right now. That's people what's are up, using it heavy, bro. And I'm fucking with that shit, bro, man. It's like it brings me back, and it, it only makes it better when they, you know, actually make a good song. <laughs> of course, of course. No, you have to flip it right. right. Yeah. Yes, because on. if you take something and fuck it up, it's gonna, you know what I mean? But you can't another, flip it wrong. On another level, shout out to them. Yeah, it's because if you take something and fuck it up, it's gonna, you know what I mean? But you can't another, flip it wrong. On another level, shout out to them people, man, because I've seen a lot of 90s remakes of beat. They, bro! Bro, they, we, this has been fucking up old beats. Okay, hold well, uh, on. Yo, when C was here last time, we were talking about Davies. And fucking C goes, oh, what's the record that Davies has? What's the record that... D bro, the reason we couldn't think of Dave East records is because C put us on the spot. Mm. But like, bro, when you when you listen to that beloved tape, it's ridiculous, it's bro. Love singles, that's the thing. Like you know how many times I listened to that tape this year? And it just came out like... Late third quarter, yeah, beginning yeah, of the fourth yeah, quarter, yeah, whatever yeah. you want to call yeah. that. You know what I'm saying? No, the, the, the Davies is the, like I don't even know what to say about this guy anymore, bro. Come on, bro. I he's just, a, I he's just a waiting like on the sideline to just see what happens next. Literally, literally. He's that, a, with that with that nigga. He's a I fucking monster. To. You never know what he's gonna do. Shout, have we ever shout out Davies no, on the show? I don't think so, man. I don't know. Shout, shout out Davies. Davies shout out Davies, really, bro. Fuck really big. This nigga is like yeah. this shit. And he's fucking with everybody and, and their motherfucking he's grandma. Co signed by every single OG that you could think of shout, lyrically. Uh, shout out to Nas, by the way, too, for. for, for, for Nas for looked out, man. Nas you looked out. Putting boys up there. Like, Nas is giving dude, them a good Oh shot, my like, gosh, did you hear that Swizz and Nas record? Uh, Echo? No. I don't think I did. You didn't hear that record? No. Oh my gosh. All right, guys. We got to we gotta put a pause on Championship. I think I'm, I think I. I think I might have on satellite. I think I might have. Damn, you have to. If you have satellite, you definitely are. Yeah, I think I think I might have, man. I'm gonna play like a. Man, just I a, can't even keep up sometimes no more, man. No. So okay, much. hold on. This year has been absolutely ridiculous. It's bro. so much, bro. It's this like, year has been absolutely ridiculous. I had a really hard time keeping up. This fuck year. it. I'm not in my car as much anymore right now, so I was like, bro. And when we have the podcast, like it's hard to keep up with everything that's coming out all the time. It's sometimes lot, we it's miss shit, bro. It's a lot. It's a lot. Like even us, like we try to do so much <laughs> that we can try to squeeze and like you know. One episode or whatever. You, you guys don't even know the stuff that we gotta try to cancel or maybe put on next episode. Bro, you know how many different topic lists I have that I write so off and we we edit them before we come in because so like, 
you know, not not everybody listens to every album. Not everybody gets to every album. So we want to talk about the albums that everybody that has the most knowledge. You know what I'm saying? So like, it's hard. This, but this is the record I'm talking about. I mean, Nas is one of the greatest. Can we get a chance? Yeah, I hear Yes. I mean, the echo of life is the echo of love, and the echo of love is the echo from above, and it's the suit that it is. I'm trying to make a villain for the kids that ain't gonna poison. Man, life can be poison. You can talk crazy and bring it forward, yeah! I dare hear this. I dare hear this. I dare hear this. Ridiculous, bro. I think I heard that last week. I think I heard that last week. That that boy, that that. Yo, we didn't even stop. We didn't even. We didn't even talk about. We didn't even talk about the poison album here. We didn't even talk about the poison album this year. The poison album was ridiculous. Insane. 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 Swiss Beats is really that guy, bro. You know what? Just when you think like he's he's sitting in the cellar or something, he just comes with a fucking a banger that just just shuts it down. Just shuts it down for the summer, the winter, whatever the fuck it is. Swizz is like that dude in the game that you can never ever sleep on. Pretty ever. Much, pretty much. Pretty much. Don't yeah. ever sleep on Swiss. Because like, you just come out of left field and make fucking 300, 300 million on that game. Easy, it's, like it's, this. Yeah. And then I'll just say, you know what, I'm going to make a try. And bro, and he did a lot and of and shit this year. He worked with Mercedes music. this year. He did the yeah, yeah, R yeah, Festival yeah, this yeah, year. Yeah. He did, uh, he, did uh, he worked with Bacardi this year. He, he, they, did, this year they, alone. they did the retail stores for Bali this year. And yeah. I'm not talking Balenciaga. Balenciaga, I'm talking Bali because it's two different brands, uh, uh, two different brands. That boy really doing his thing like on a different entrepreneur, entrepreneur level, like you know what I'm saying? Like he really doing his thing. Bro, after he went back to Harvard, he became a monster. It's, it's in amazing. Business. You know, you know where you knew, you knew where it was, and he monopolized off it. It's a genius, man. Shout out to Swiss, man. Shout out. Swiss is fucking absolutely that's ridiculous. genius man and he's all still right. making them fire man all right so hold up let's go back to the championship album because we got totally fucking sidetracked that's okay that's okay it's all good it's your show you do it i don't give a fuck this is my show motherfucking you right you know how we right. jump in this you motherfucking shit, right motherfucker. this is my motherfucking show you smoke and drink. i do what the fuck i want a in this bitch you funky bitch <laughs> All right, so championships. Come on, man. All right, so we so, so we left off at um. We left the what's what's, what's that, free? That shit is. That shit that, is. <coughs> you know, you're what, right. you know, that you know shit what I mean. Is you know, you know, you know what I got. You know what I have to say. No. It's going to be a classic. It's going to be a detrimental Preach. mark. Preach. Hip hop history. Preach. And that's all that we need to you say. You goddamn right. right now. You goddamn right. Cause me fucking did his thing times a million right now and he's fucking Times hoes. fucking five billion. Fuck these motherfuckers up, man. Uh, um, all right, so let's jump into Sauce Walkers. Oh, that Sauce Ghetto Gospel. That is my nigga. Sauce? Sauce Walker? Sauce Business? The Sauce Father motherfucker? That guy is so versatile, drip, man. Drip God. The originator... The flavor originator, the man bro. who stepped in bro. first with the most. They come out with a fucking sabra, sir. Fuck it. But then he'd be on the block, they get chip you out and rob a nigga. And then he can still make some real, like, you know, some real head music, some real lyrical shit. And all and fucking, all fucking it, blooded man. out. And he's, he's fucking it, still man. got that shit. I used to fuck it on, like, on YouTube and shit. I used to watch it, and I would just binge on Sauce Walker fucking, like, videos, man. Like, all day. Like, all day. And I was like, this bro, that's how is I, the truth, guys. I've been, I've been here for, like, five, five hours. Bro, <laughs> to be honest, bro, my boy Carlo got me yeah, into Sauce Walker straight up. Yeah, so shout knows, out to man. Carlo, because you already know, bro. Shout out to you, bro. Um, 
he got me into sauce walker like i really started fucking with sauce and then like i just took it to a whole nother level like for real, for real. sauce is like uh, he's he's not only is he lyrical but he's got the new flavor yeah. like yeah. and like he's knowledgeable he's, he's, too bro yeah he's got that mixed um, man where it's like you can't bro. Not love it like bro. no homo like this nigga is like the, this nigga is cool as shit like you know what I'm saying? He fucked with all the, the shit coolest. that we used to fuck with in the he 90s. Is, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Bro. I mean, this nigga is real, man. Like, bro. He's real. Brand- and he's there. Hey, man. That, what's that song? What's that song? You're, Family. You're showing, you're showing, if I, God damn. Family. This nigga has a real little good shit, right? This nigga's not just like that uh, slow guy shit. Like, he's, nah, he's, he's, not, he's not only is he a jokester and that, like, is he like funny, like he's that. serious about his music yeah. too. You know what I'm saying? So... That's that's what's dope about Sauce. He's got a personality, and he's like, and he's lit in the, in music. So like, ready. yeah, you gotta give you gotta give Sauce credit where where it's due, man. Because he he doesn't really get the credit for drip because he started that drip and shit. He started the whole Sauce movement. The fuck, his team is called the Sauce Family, Fuck. the Sauce Factory. Yeah. Like, yeah. bro. That's nice. Yeah, I told, I told, you, yeah. Like he's Sometimes the originator. Yeah, people yeah. aren't giving him his yeah, credit. Yeah, you know what I'm like, saying? Like, totally a lot of people aren't stuff. giving it to Gunna, but like, it's it. You know, it's it's not no competition, but like, Sauce is the originator. Yeah, like, he needs, you he know, needs to get his hand. Yeah, like the fucking Sauce twins. Like, yeah, yeah those bro, boys them were. Them boys, them boys, man. Sosa man, shout out to Sosa. Sosa man is doing big things. Sign with Taylor, Gang, bro, man. Fuck. Like man. them, them boys, like really, really. You know what they got that they got that vibe and they and they got that fan base man. They got that hustle. That's and what that's they got. Like, yeah, bro. of course. To all, anybody to be in that shit, you gotta have that motherfucking grind mode. Like you know what I'm saying? If you're not about that shit, then bounce like cause them niggas about Some money. motherfuckers got lucky, bro. Some motherfuckers got lucky. That's true. They get shit, they 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 you know what I'm saying, they make a single and they blow up or yeah. whatever and then they yeah, but Sauce been, has yeah. been doing this shit, shit from exactly. time. Exactly. exactly. That's what I wanted. Shout out to that nigga, man. Real time, man. Mm-hmm. So I that nigga, man. For real, for real. That nigga. Start that shit up one more time and we're done. Ooh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. So. I want to talk about Brendan's baby. Brendan's got a baby. Because, mm. like, he played off Tupac's Brenda's got a baby. Mm. So, did you hear that record? Uh, mm. I don't think so. Yo, Sauce, don't clip me for this, fam. Don't clip me for this, bro, please. I'm giving you huge props. No, I never heard this. I never heard this. And this is off the... Kill it, kill it. No, I never heard it. No, I never heard it. I never heard it. This nigga is coming with that, that kind of... Yo, it's... I, oh, fuck. No, I never heard it. Oh, 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 no, I never Killed it, murdered it, set it on fire, set the whole fucking it's, Texas on fire. It's so with this weird because it feels like he's got like a Philly, New York kind of background. Sometimes when it comes with those fire. Yo, kinda. so take this in. He was he was born in Chicago. That's why he's fucking. That's why he's got a little bit of East Coast that's flavor in there. Why. His mom is from Chicago originally. I know my shit. If you guys sleep on me, that's I swear yeah. to. I, like, I don't even want to go there, but don't yeah. sleep on me, because I know my uh, fucking okay, shit over here. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah but Sauce right, has... Because he's, he, you know what I'm saying? Like, <coughs> yeah, he's, he's originally from it, Chicago yeah, and yeah, moved to Texas later. His drip, his drip. Yeah. That boy, man. Shut up, man. That nigga stay doing his shit. Like, and it, he come up with bangers. He's like, you know what I'm saying? His whole clip doing his thing right now. The whole... Boss, the stuff him boss really him and right. Sosa Man are doing happy, yeah, happy yeah, things. Yeah. That boy... Rizzo, Rizzo, doing big. Yeah. That boy, Rizzo, Rizzo, doing big things. Them boys just eat, man. boys just starting to eat. Big things. Them boys just eat, man. Them boys just starting to eat, man. That shit, like, shout out to that and shit. And they're cause... doing all independent shit. That's yeah, why I don't think that, he'll really give me shit for clips. You know what I'm saying? Now, man. Not... 
Bro, that's what the movement is right now. You know what I'm saying? That's what we're doing over here. If you guys need help, that's what Speaker Rhythm Entertainment does. At the end of the day, if you can do it for yourself, why have someone else do it for you? Preach. Right? So, Fucking right. Uh, Fucking right. Said, man, even, even to you, man, yeah. you, you, know, you always welcome us to, you know, to do Bro. what you gotta do. And, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is a family. We're trying to build a family unit a over here. Flex, yeah. You know what I'm saying? We got to connect all ends of the city together, bro. That's shout, exactly shout, what Shout out to all the people that showed us love, too. Yeah, they for real, family, man. too. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, we gave you guys mm-hmm. big love, big love, big shout outs. We'll do more shout outs. The more subscribers, the more um, comments that you guys give, the more comments that you guys leave on the episodes. Fucking go and comment and we're gonna give you guys shout outs i promise you guys can get your ig shouted out like we'll give you guys shout outs here on the show it's not a problem we want to show love just as much as you guys show love it's we good. really it's really appreciate that shit. Man. yeah for man sure, sure. it's all love 2019 it's no hate no negative bullshit. like speaker rhythms entertainment is just trying to help people that's why we're here that's that's our goal in 2019. Like, how can you hate it when the gang gets close and you know, we parlay like we usually do. You know what I'm saying? Smoking. We're just, we're, yeah, it's a family vibe over uh, here. I look, hate this, man. I look how many this. people literally come through the door. You know, we're all just kicking the air. It's two techs usually. It's Frost here usually. Y2K is here. Choney Beats is here. Controversy C, you know. We're always arguing with that motherfucker. He's always, like our Joe Budden always, in, in this bitch. Always. You know what I'm saying? He's like our version of Joe Budden. But that boy, that, <laughs> shout that, out to Joe. That that boy, um, that boy, that boy controversy. See, I, I feel like I feel like in the back of my neck, like he's gonna be showing up in the next couple episodes. I feel like. Oh, controversy will be here. Yeah, really controversy will be here. He's off. Know. He's he's in the cut, steady. I think like maybe like when I come back from Jamaica, like I think, I feel like I feel it coming because like he was so easy to do. He was so easy to help us. With the, with the, with oh, the I second one, right? That one. That's okay, man. Oh, as we're yeah, talking man. about controversy, see? Yeah. I free yeah. That's how you know. That's how you know. That's how you know. He's always here, bro. That's it. He's here in spirit. You see that shit? He made me fucking free blow that shit. Let's vape it up so it doesn't stink. All right. You know what that is. So, Give not, not only is this album fire, but... Sauce Waka made it on Jay Z's playlist on like title and shit. Big. That's huge. Big. Big. That, that boy did get rated. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, he did get rated. No, I feel like he doesn't get enough rating. No, but I mean, but he's been getting his rating from every, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, from a couple little, people have co signed you know him still, but like, from no. But you're know, like, even down south, like, you know what I'm saying? Uh, even Atlanta niggas, like, they be fucking, they be fucking with him, bro. They be fucking with him. Like, he goes on shit, like, he goes, goes fuck with him for a minute, and then they got into a little beef, and then they rekindled their shit, and then they got back into some beef. Um, probably, probably money or something. Slim Thug fuck with him hard. Yeah. Slim yep. Thug co-signed him early. Bun B, I believe, is on this album on a song called Recipe. Nice. It's not. It's not on this album, but it was yeah, a. Si- from, it was a sing. It was a single that dropped not too long ago. If you that didn't hear that surprised. track, that's fire. Bum B and Sauce Walker, the recipe or recipe. Mm. Fire. Nice. Fire. I thought it's not. Bum B. You went Bum B. Yo, I think I actually heard that on the side too. I think I heard that on the side. Further ado, me and two texts will bid you adieu. Uh, we're not trying oh, to, nice. we're not oh, trying nice. to, yeah, but we're jacking for Joe Buddy, cause Joe Buddy be saying I bid you adieu. Oh, is he? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so we don't want to fucking, no, no, no. But shout outs to everybody who's been fucking with us in 2018. Only more things to come for 2019. I want to thank DJ Two Tax. Always, always, um, thanks for having Two Tax is thanks always in the building. You already know what it is. Like the video. Thank you, thank you Subscribe guys. to the channel. Subscribe, don't man. forget. Comment down w below man. for your shout out. We love man. you guys so much. Thank you so much from Speaker Rhythms Entertainment and your host GQ, aka Johnny Bravo. You already wow. know what it is for 2019. Gang shit. Gang you shit. funky fucking bitch. You. Let's get it.